Hello and welcome to Trojan Talk. I'm your host, Aaron Taylor. Today we'll learn about a way that the community can help student veterans here on campus. And my guest today is the president of the Student Veterans Association here at Troy, Reeves Johnson. Reeves, thanks for joining us here today. Thank you for having me. And as I mentioned, uh, helping out student veterans, uh, a lot of times people are not aware that there are veterans that are going to school here on campus, but we're going to talk about a fun way uh, that's become an annual event here, the Ruckathon. Uh, yes. So tell us a little about the Ruckathon. What, as a matter of fact, for those who don't know, what is a Ruckathon? Okay, so a Ruck is, it's sort of like a backpack. It's typically a little bit bigger. Um, and we're going to fill it with about 30 pounds worth of goods in order to make it all the same weight. Um, you're going to have about teams of five. Um, and the registration fee is going to be about $50 per team. Um, and you're going to ruck around the track for about four hours um, from 12 to 4. Um, and you, you take turns. So mm -hmm. one person will have the ruck, um, take a few laps, and then somebody else will change out. Um, a lot of members of the military have to ruck regularly. <laughs> um, so it's just a fun way to kind of walk in their shoes. And, and obviously walk in their shoes by getting an experience that you know, like you said, military do all the time, but regular citizens aren't aware that this is the kind of literal burden that some of the, the members of the military have to deal with. Why is it so important for, for students to, and, and just anyone out there, be aware of, of what vets have to go through? Well, for one, it's a, it's a different world altogether. Mm -hmm. I personally started here as a tr traditional student. I was not originally in the military when I first came in. I um, mean, I can tell you there's a huge difference. There are things that I would have just never understood otherwise. So it's a good way to kind of try to bridge that gap and, and make sure that there's an understanding because I feel like there are a lot of misconceptions about student veterans and what they're about. They're, they don't always have to be older students. A lot of them are. And that's fine. We love to support those veterans as well. But we have a bunch of people who are around my age, um, mid-20s, late-20s, 30s, and, and they're not supposed to be intimidating. Um, it's a good way to allow them to see more of what our student veteran body is about. And they get to do this, and, and like I said, it's a fun way. It's almost like, you know, there's a lot of walks out there for, for charities and things of that sort, but this adds a new spin to that by incorporating the, the ruck to it. And so uh, talk a little bit, about, I guess, about uh, what it takes to get a team together. How can, can a team participate and get their team together and, and sign up for this? Okay, so you need five members. Um, okay. We've asked a lot of Greek organizations to make teams, and we have gotten a few um, who've, who've been interested. Um, if you can just get four other people together and you can come by our troop center at uh, the Trojan Center is room 122 next to Rico or okay. the uh, Dollar Movie Night <laughs> the, stand. The, the, the stand out there where you buy the tickets is right across from that for the students. So. Um, if they can come by there and give us a check made out to the SVA um, for $50, they're more than welcome to come rock. And even if they don't want to rock, they can come observe. Uh, we love having people come out there. And now, is there now we hadn't touched on this? Is there a competitive aspect to this as well? There, is there is there is there like a prize for the best rucking team out there? We actually have a lot of prizes okay. this year from various businesses who were kind enough to donate to us, um, and we will have their sponsorship list out there. Um, there will be lots of prizes we're going to give them for teams, um, and there is a bit of competition. I, I know for a fact we've got three teams from the Army ROTC, okay. and I know they're going to compete against each other to see who can do it the fastest, and I'm sure Air Force ROTC will as well. Um, hopefully everybody gets competitive. It's, it's part of the military spirit uh, as well as camaraderie. And, of course, if anyone – they don't make a team, but they still want to help out or participate. Uh, folks can come out and spectate, and there's going to be some other uh, activities and, and things like that out there at the event as well, right? Yes, absolutely. I would love for them to come see and get involved and see what we're about. Um, I feel like a lot of misconception is that we're simply a counseling center, and we're not. We're, we're supposed to be a place for student veterans to find their, themselves in college um, and allow themselves to become successful students and go beyond that. Um, and a lot of that is finding friends, finding somebody to lean on, um, finding a way to get involved. Um, and you don't have to be a veteran to get involved. You can be a student to be part of the SVA. You can be just a regular civilian, somebody who wants to help the troops. And of course, and and that's all part of being a part of the Ruckathon, but also taking advantage of the Troy for Troops Center. So if there's maybe there's a student veteran out there who's watching this and is thinking, hey, I want to 
seek out some some help here. They can go to the Troy for Troop Center and 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 find more out of, about more of this organization. Correct. So of course, uh, the Troy for Troop Center isn't simply the SBA. We mm -hmm. also have the Salute Veteran Honor Society, mm -hmm. um, and that's a great thing to put on your resume. Um, but on top of that, there are people there from all walks of life. You don't have to be a veteran either. You can be a dependent, a contracted ROTC cadet. Okay. So it's anyone military affiliated who is using benefits of some sort. All right. Well, for the Ruckathon, uh, when and where uh, is the Ruckathon when folks want to participate in this? Okay. The Ruckathon is November 11th from right. 12 to 4.30. 12 to 4.30 on Veterans Day. Yes. Uh, out at the track. Yes. And an opportunity to uh, have a little fun and help uh, bring some awareness to veterans here on campus. Uh, good luck with this year's event. And thank, thank you for so joining much. us. So, and thank you for joining us on today's edition of Trojan Talk.